Hey guys, it's Bud, of course, 22 back here. Um, gameplay, commentary kind of thing. I'm just going to be talking about Modern Warfare 3. This is part 2 video. And the gameplay is just, I think it's Ground War Domination. Alright. Now, back to what I was saying. Now we're going to go on to the kill streaks. Alright, now for the assault tier kill, stre kill streaks, we have four kills, you get a care package. Same as Modern Warfare 2. Black Ops, you get a care package, random stuff. Five kills, totally new, IMS. Now this is like three to four, I'm not sure, placeable landmines that can't be stunned or flashed. And I think they just let you put them down. I don't know if you can see them very well. I'm assuming you can't because it takes five kills to get it. And they just go up in the air and just explode whenever someone walks over it. I think that's going to be kind of annoying, but kind of cool due to first use. Five kills, also you get a Predator Missile. We all know how good that is. You can get like five kills with it. Really good. And then also five kills, sentry gun. Standard from all the other call duties. Six kills six kills, precision precision airstrike. Same thing on Modern Warfare 2, back to that. Seven kill streaks. Oh sorry, seven kills. <laughs> Attack helicopter. Same thing as Black Ops. Seven kills. Totally new. Little bird flock. This is mini kill helicopters which patrol the map. This is gonna be something I don't know if it's gonna be good or not, but we'll see. I don't know what they're going to look like, but I think this could be pretty cool and a pretty good kill streak. If you really want, like, fire to be coming from all over the map, and if you're trying to, like, dom get domination points, and the helicopter is shooting just different parts of the map. Nine kills. Little bird guard. This is going to be, I think, going to be pretty cool. A uh, helicopter follows you abo from above and protects you while you're running on the map. Also, nine kills. Mortar team. This mortar team is... I don't know how overpowered this is going to seem to you, but five Predator Missiles? But they all go off at the same time in different places, so I don't know how you're going to control that or anything, but we'll see. I think that's going to be really powerful if like, you're playing uh, Demolition or um, Sabotage, stuff like that, Domination. Alright, ten kills, Talcon. Talcon or something like that? I don't know. I see a mini tank robot. I'm, I'm not too sure what this is. But it seems really cool from what I've heard, and can't wait to check that out. 12 kills, happy about this, AC-130, can't wait to use it, it's an awesome kill streak, and I like that they made it 12 and not, I can't remember what it was before, maybe it was 12, I don't remember, but I think it was 12, yeah, for Modern Warfare 2, I can't remember, haven't played that game in a while, just been playing Black Ops, that's going to be an awesome kill streak to use again, can't wait to use that. 12 kills also paid well, I like how they extended it from 9 to 12. They must have made it a little more powerful than it used to be, but we'll see. 15 kills, totally new to Modern Warfare 3. Juggernaut suit. I think that this gives you a lot more health and gives you like that suit kind of thing from Modern Warfare 2. I think it was Modern Warfare 2. Yeah, the spec ops from that. I mean, I think you get a riot shield and I'm not sure, maybe like a light machine gun, I think. That's going to be, I think that's going to be kind of cool, but I think you're really slow, so I, I don't know, you might die really fast because everyone's going to shoot you one time. And also, 15 kills, we have an Osprey Gunner CPS. You control a Chopper Gunner that also drops emergency airdrop for your teammates. That's going to be really good for, for winning games. That can change the course of a game like that. I mean, you can go from getting dominated and down by 50 points in domination game to winning with that. Okay, now for the support tier kill streaks, you have 4 kills as a UAV. Standard. I think that that's gonna be pretty good. Five kills, counter UAV. Five kills, ballistic duffel. Drops the juggernaut perk for the whole team, not the juggernaut suit though. That's gonna be really good, I think, for like capturing flags and stuff, and like getting the flag, uh, planting a bomb. In general, that's gonna be, I think, a real, uh, a really good support perk. Also, as five is a air airdrop trap. Drops a hacked care package. I don't think that's gonna be any good. I mean, just I think it's just one care package. We'll see. 8 kills, also SAM turret. Remember, it's more kills than the previous one because I think these, these carry over from, like, your, say if I'm in the middle of the game and I die and I spawn again and I get more kills, it adds to my support tier. Kill streak, so they add up, unlike the assault tier. Okay, and then 10 kills is a remote missile UAV, targets enemies with missiles. Not sure what that is. Sounds really, really powerful, so I hope that it's not too powerful. 12 kills, advanced UAV, aka the Blackbird. This, I think, they might have screwed up this uh, support tier kind of kill streak thing because 
12 kills is really easy to get a game. If you start with your, if you only use the support tier for your kill streak, you can get a, a blackbird for your team every game. That just seems like really easy to do. Also, with 12 kills, you get a remote turret, basically a sentry gun that you control. 12 kills, stealth bomber. We've seen that before. Really good. 18 kills, EMP. Seen that in Modern Warfare 2. That was I think 15 kills in Modern Warfare 2. 18 kills is Juggernaut Recon Armor. I'm not sure what this is, but I know that it drops like care package that with armor in it. I, I, I'm sorry, I can't elaborate that, but I'll elaborate on it. But we'll see what that really is. Also with 18 kills, air escort airdrop. Same as the Osprey Gunner, but you don't control the gunner, and you drop five care packages. One will be hacked. That again, that can change the game. Easy. And if you have a team of people that are actually pretty good, and you go into like ground war, and you're all using the support tier kill streaks, you can get. Everyone on your team can get one of those. I think that's going to be really overpowered and not that fair. But I could be wrong. Okay, and then your last one is specialist tier. Every two kills you get up to six kills, you get an extra perk. So you get two kills, you get another perk, four, another perk, six, another perk. Uh, but these, the perks go away after you die. This, I think, is going to be pretty awesome because you don't want any kill streaks really. Because I don't think you can use all of them, obviously, at the same time. So I think you're only allowed to use one per game that we play. So I think that that's going to be pretty awesome. And I don't want to make this another part, so I'm going to hurry this up real fast, sorry. Uh, and then the equipment is flashbang, concussion grenade, scrambler, EMP grenade, smoke, trophy system, tactical insert, and portable radar. Trophy system, you put it down and it stops like noob tubes and grenades from attacking you. Alright, so thanks for watching. Um, I might make a part three. Alright, like if you guys want, and subscribe if you guys